Hi everyone! Today I'll be showing you how to use Quizlet on a MacBook. Before we get started, I just want to let you know that if I'm going too fast in this explanation, please feel free to go back or forward into the video to follow your own pace. So let's get started. First, we need to get onto the Quizlet website. Go onto your browser and type in quizlet.com. Once you've done that, it'll take you to Quizlet's main homepage right here. Once we're here, we have to log in. It's best to have an account, so if you don't have one, we can make one right now. To make an account, click on the sign up button on the top right corner. It is in yellow. We'll click on this, and there are several options to make an account. You can either make an account with Google or with Facebook, or you can use an email. You can put in the necessary info, like your birthday, email, username, password, and then you can just sign up right here. But be sure to write down your email login on a piece of paper or somewhere where you won't lose it in case that you have to log into the website again. But if you do have an account, instead of clicking sign up, you can just click on log in. When we're on login, you can either log in by Google, log in with Facebook, or log in by Apple, or just log in by your email. Since I already have an account, I can just get logged in right away. Now that my info is on here, I can just click log in. Now that we're here, I'll take you to the home page. If you've used the account before, it'll show all of your used study sets. But since I don't have any here, I can just make my own or search them up using the search bar on the top right. So for example, if I want to learn Spanish verbs, I can just type in Spanish verbs and it'll take me to this page. There'll be all results, study sets, textbooks, questions, users, classes, and courses. But it, to find an easy set to use, just click on study sets and you'll be able to find many different sets made by other people. You can click on the one that works the best for you. So we can just click on the first one to show as an example. Here on the left side, there'll be different activities that help you learn vocabulary. For the flashcards, you can just click each card and then go to the next card and do so like this. If not, you can do the other activities like learn, learn, write, spell, test, and there is even some smaller games called match and gravity. Now we can just Go back to Spanish if you just want to look at Spanish again and then you'll be able to find even more within Spanish over here. But if you don't want to use someone else's account and you want to make your own study set, go back to home and you can click on create and then you can do a study set. Here you can type in the name of your study set and the description and then you'll be able to add your vocab here and the definition. That's how to use Quizlet. Thanks for watching.